Welcome back, all you crazy cool people. This is Game Edge. We are back in the forest. Yes, unbelievable. We're near another update. These guys are amazing. <laughs> Alright, so, um, yeah. Devs are going to be releasing a new update, which is really exciting. I'm very excited by it. And uh, in case you haven't seen this and you missed the last episodes, uh, we put up some skulls and stuff. I have a couple left to do. I tried to, I, while I was doing some work, I kind of got some stuff done. I made a video. Unfortunately, it kind of failed on me in between. So, the rock did stay up here, and I've got to take it off because I built another rock, and I couldn't throw them away. I felt bad, so yeah, it doesn't look very nice, does it? I think I have to build a rack here instead. I don't know. It seems like it doesn't work at all. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, so new update. Oh, not not this. Jesus. Um, yeah, I, what I want to do is um, one more time. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so we're actually going to have a brand new update, which I'm really excited about. I mean, again, how can you not be excited? This is this is a game that's given us so much, uh, and so much of it is going to be so cool <laughs> that we can actually get new stuff every so often. So it's like Christmas. I know some of you have brought up that, you know, we'd like to see a lot of things done. Give the devs a chance. They've actually only done is given us production on a brand new things, so and this is better than having to pay for DLCs and games. And this is uh, early access. I mean, this is part of life of early access. You accept the, the flaws and the things that are going to happen and being part of the game. And uh, you know what? You, you get flaws anyways. I won't let me put it in there unless I... Sons of bitches. Anyways, it's okay. Um, yeah, they won't let us do it anyways. So it makes no difference. This is actually... There we go. Rock here. Put another one here. I think we can fill this up. At least a couple of them. Eh, it's better than the other little rock that I just put up. It doesn't look very nice. So yeah, we just actually make the paint itself. We just grab ourselves a rock. And there we go. Here's another another one. We can actually drop it right here. It's not perfect, but it's going to have to do, unfortunately. Um, okay, we'll just put, I was able to find some blueberries. I uh, went hunting. It took a little while, so again, a real boring part. We'd have been watching that. Um, and there was not much action. If there was anything really cool, like, you know, Cowman or Virginia or anything else coming in, I would be on it like you would not believe. Uh, you guys would be right in there. You'd be watching it. So, again, always ready to record. Doesn't happen. Then we don't, you know, don't want you guys have to go through that. All right, so let's get this done. We have our Blue Thunders back. Cool. And we got ourselves some rocks here. Adds a little bit to it. Uh, better than that little rack here. It was in between both, but that stupid rack back there just isn't doesn't come up properly. I just don't like it. Should have incorporated that a little bit into the rock, but before I built the bay. Part of life. Again, this is our altar over there, so so be it. So make sure our fires are stoked. I just don't want to waste any wood. Not as if we don't have regrow mode on, which really is worthwhile if you've never done it before. In the menu itself, when you first start the game, you just press type in regrow in one mode. Right? Regrow mode in one word. And there you go, you'll have it. Again, I'm curious to see if the devs are going to start doing anything about... Um, what they're going to be adding to this game. I wonder if they're going to do anything about the problems of the AI right now. That would probably be the best thing for us to see. I find that, like if you said before, uh, I don't see very many of them. And it's kind of odd that we don't see any more in the daylight uh, as much as we used to. And also, some of the stuff that's regrowing, uh, I find a little hard to find. So just grab and make sure the rocks are full, because I am dropping off a whole bunch of rocks over here. If you're wondering what that is, that's just a log over there. There we go. We'll make sure we're full. Again, I'm just, oh, I might have wasted that, damn it. Um, yeah, like I was trying to say, the, the cloth itself, I'd like to have a full cloth, but i also like to see if there's anything going on at this area, and plus seeing if there's any blueberries or any kind of other plants like aloe. And it's part of my routine of walking through, so we'll, we'll go to this little base here right next to us. It's not far away, which is nice. It's not like I'm making you go to the big base, but this is a must. Uh, the amount of cloth we're going through this season is insanity. It really is. I don't think we need more rope, do we? No, we all have four rope. It's wasting it. Wasting our time trying to grab it. Uh, looks like there's not much here. This we should be able to pick up to the cloth. Yeah, we could explode that, but there's nothing underneath that. It sure is quiet. Kind of not liking that at all. And we're in our base, we should see some activity. And again, I hope that's one thing they're going to be working on. I know you guys probably have some things you wish for. Uh, I always wish for that, so there's always something different. Uh, we still have athleticism one. Right now we're on a meat morning, kind of meat and flour diet and berries if we can. 
Uh, so we're going to stick with that for a bit and see what happens. Again, our strength going up. Again, we're just gathering with the strength with protein and see if that's actually embedded in the game. All right, let's go back. Obviously, no, uh, nobody's near their bases. There we go. A little more cloth. Awesome. And we'll head back this way here. There's usually some aloe around here on the ground over there. Let's we'll double check to see before we head out. Yep. So, if I might be sounding a little more nasally than usual, I'm battling a heavy amount of allergies for some reason, which give me kind of like a migraine. So it's in between the recording. I'm not holding myself off recording because you know, one way or another, I just love playing. So I do have to take rest between them, but <laughs> it's okay. It's not the end of the world. It's just allergies. No one's dying. It's a part of life. I just have to accept it. All right, we'll take a little bit more energy mix. Make sure we're nice and stable. Same time, it feeds us up, so it's real good. I don't see any plants growing here. Usually, there's plants here, but it looks like uh... I've always wondered if that if we're chopping down trees, does that affect it in any way, where the plants are actually regrowing? Because we chopped down all the trees over there, and we used to get tons of plants, and now they no longer show up. Oh, there's some here. We might get lucky actually with these. Usually, I find some aloe. We got blueberry bush. How many blueberries do we have? Could top ourselves off. We're gonna eat meat tonight. That's good. Beautiful. Wow. We've been very lucky now. We're all of a sudden seeing this. Or is it it's some kind of rotationary thing? Is there some kind of timer in this game that allows us to get certain you know You know what I'm talking about? Like is there a timer in this game that says, okay, now from this point forward, you're gonna get some you're gonna get these things or you know like a delayed timer for each save. I don't know. It could be. Uh, I have no clue how these guys are developing. It's very hard to communicate with them. Unfortunately, they are very busy, I'm sure. But um, again, it seems like the veil of secrecy is up on that and they're building as they go. Which I can't blame because they do have a concrete story since you've seen it change. It's a complete aspect of it. And I wonder if they're going to add more clues now. Now with the magazine, Bring Back the Dead, a lot of you brought up some good points and you know it made me think too at the same time. But again, will this be that you know a different story where the actually he's coming back to try and resurrect his wife? Because the magazine doesn't the magazine say that? I'm not mistaken. I'm talking my ass and you guys are going, no man, it's completely wrong, dude. There you go. TV star wife TV star's wife dies. All right, and now we have this artifact, uh, ancient artifact. Can this device bring back the dead? And these are pretty close to each other in the actual book, so there's a there's definitely a lead between both, and that's something we have to look at as being maybe an ability, uh, maybe a part of the story now. And so maybe it changed completely. We had all these thought processes of what, you know, what it could be. Um, again, it could be a TV show too, where he's bringing back his dead, uh, you know, his dead wife on TV with his artifact. Uh, it could be many things. Again, Timmy's drawings did not show any of that, where his dad maybe mentioned that to him. Let's get the sap here. There's none in this one? Wow. All right. And, uh, yeah, so maybe. I don't know what you guys are thinking. Maybe we'll get some more uh, clues this update. It's very, very possible. These devs, uh, again, doing it at their pace and building a very concrete game, which, I'm, I mean, you can't say you don't enjoy this game. It'd be impossible. This game is absolutely stunning. You can build so much. Now, there's a couple things I've... Mentioned I'd like to see a little more ability to build and freedom to build. If I want to build a dock or utilize some parts, I'd like the parts to be actually be able to go out. And, you know, some things to s different to see and all that, that would be kind of cool. Uh, but I would like to also just be able to do what I want to do without it saying I can't. So if I put on like a rock on here, or if I want to put something uh, like I was doing over there, I want ability to put what I want to put. I think you guys understand what I'm talking about. I'm just repeating myself here. Just put the, kind of a rail here. Beautiful. It's a little too far out. Let's see what we can do. Right, let's do that one more time. Before the cannibals start coming. Usually the bonfires lately, they've been out and about. Don't walk in it, yeah. I don't know if they're going to come tonight or not, but we'll keep them stoked up anyways, because I do like the company. And plus, we need to finish the top part, too. 
and also the skulls over there. So we do need their body parts and also like to finalize some little things. Uh, and the left hand side, the left hand side is not built and a lot of you have been asking what we're going to do there. Um, I've been working on some projects of mentally trying to put it together. Uh, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll get that done. Don't worry. I promise you. Boy, that was completely crooked, brother. I was looking upwards when I was doing that. There we go. Some of you were like, man, you missed that completely. Okay, let's make sure I'm not walking that fire. That's perfect. Oh, yeah, I just put down the rocks. Brilliant. Let's go here and grab some more. Let's add a little more flame to make sure that when I'm doing the rendering, it comes out nicer. And we'll grab the rest of the rocks from down there. Just like to have a full load and not waste the rocks that we have. And plus, there's tons here on the on side, so it's all good. Gives us a little bit of protection for them, but they're still going to jump over this without any problems. Unless it's double wall. You seem to have a hard time jumping over this fence, though. This side here. It's because of the uh, log sled being in the way. Damn log sled. Cool. Could be a little more straight, eh? Is this one a little bit out like that? No, this one's really straight. Oh yes, my inner side does come out sometimes. I can't help it. It's gotta be straight. It's the reason why I'm not doing it like this properly is because of the damn bonfire. It's freaking me out. We must do what we must do. Ah, oh, shit. Like that. You see what I'm talking about? These guys are going to think it's fine. Yeah, you'll laugh about it. I'll kick your ass in about two seconds. All right. Where are you? Where the hell did you go? One, two, three. Cool. Just smack the crap out of this guy. He's in the perfect place. We'll grab his teeth. I hope they got a good dental plan, brother. Where's the other guy gone? He's gone? All right. I know Gary has been asking that to uh, another Gary that put a challenge for me to beat someone down with a shell. And I've done this before. This one would be first time. Did you burn yourself? Wow. You know, at least I'm not alone. Now, this shell does work really well. If you want to hear. Oh, okay. There we go. Except when you're getting smacked around. Now, it does take up quite a bit of energy when you're doing this. I like to bring him closer to the fire, though. It's pissing me off. Come over here. Are you going to run away? Seriously? Ah, oh, that's better. Can't help yourself, eh? Now, it takes a long time to hit these guys. I remember doing this uh, last season, early on, when I was starting to build uh, the last fort. Last of three forts. Well, okay, it's not going to really help me when he's burning himself to death. Yeah, that really wasn't a good test. But again, I can't do it in multiple. This would take us so much energy. Uh, we'll drop him here. Our cooking. Make a cooking pit here. Hello? Would you like to convert? Wow, he's going to convert right away. Awesome. We okay, need to stop being established, your brother. Okay, Blue Thunder, you can't... All right, you need to calm down. <laughs> calm down, sir. Calm... Holy Jesus. You brought Flaming Boy, too. All right, I'm oh, sorry about the... We're going to wait for a second. Uh, we're going to Katana mode. Katana mode 3 before he burns down our place. Or our trees. Come here. No fire, boy. No for fire. Now these bonfires take care of themselves, don't they? There we go. I don't want to knock down that. Ooh. Wow. Alright, let's just get some uh, energy. Blue Thunder. Convert! 
See what happens if you don't convert? You burn alive or you get killed. Come on. Unless you guys were here for conversion. I'm so sorry. But I don't think uh, I, you guys are coming in for that. Let's drop your friend over here. As a no side. Hmm. Gotta try a turtle shell. I say I'm gonna try it. I'll try it. Oh, he's just getting smacked up. How's it feel, brother? Oh, man, you're getting bloodied up. My wall is getting destroyed. Oh, I threw a rock at him. <laughs> oh, that's destroying our walls. Did he just die? I think the guy just clobbered him. Yeah, let's take it for even for when he's down. Well, we got a lot of converts. Yes. 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 Holy shit. Shit just got crazy, man. Shit just got crazy. Whoa, man. Okay, this is not where they're going to church run, brother. Oh, my God. Look at this. Wow. All right. Let them bring out the katana here. Crowd control. Obviously, they don't want to convert. They're here to destroy. We'll bring your friends over here. Hey, how you doing? Here, have a snack, honey. Free snacks. Oh, right in the fire again, brother. Sorry. <laughs> Phantom hits, phantom hits. See, no one's around me. Phantom hits again. Oh, I have no more, uh, I have no more armor. Holy shit. All fun and games just ended right now. All right. Let's give ourselves some of that. Let's fill yourself up a bit. Let's fix that up. Oh my god. Oh my gorder. Come on, guys. It's enough. Either join. Alright, that's it. I had enough of this shit. Oh man. I think I broke our shit here. Oh! <laughs> You got clobbered big time. Just the good old boys. Never mean no harm. There we go. Shh. Go to sleep. How you doing? How you doing? Just stay right there. You're perfectly placed. Yeah, we'll cook you right here. Look at that. You don't need to get up. Nothing. Service. All right, that's cool. That's actually going to help us quite a bit for the bones. Man, that armor went down pretty quick. I'm happy we got some cloth because we're gonna need to build ourselves some new armor with some of these bones too. Wow, that's pretty good. So, Shell, yeah, I guess you can knock down people. It takes a lot of energy. I probably do it more in one on one. Uh, I guess defensively it does help, but I, I wouldn't uh, would say it's the best weapon out there. But definitely, definitely a challenge. It's always fun. Um, yeah, let's bring back our health in case. Is there anything else done here? We have no bodies that fell off here. That maybe we missed on fire. <laughs> oh, she just came back. She was like, me! There we go. There we go. Anybody else? We missed anybody else? Oh, yeah, we did. Wow. That's a lot of bodies. Here we go. I don't even know how much of that was, but that's that's a lot. I'm not even sure if that's not more than usual. We had last time, but it's hard to tell anymore. They come in such weird packs. Um, I'm just going up here for one second. I just want to show you something really cool. If you missed the last episode, I just love when this happens. If I go far enough from this and I come back in, look at legs. There they go! 
Look at legs, they're all happy. Isn't that cool? <laughs> it's definitely a ragdoll issue that they have, but it's okay. It's kind of cool. And okay, we'll stoke up all three fires and we'll cook the, uh, our little bait here. Well, our bait, our food. At the same time, we'll build this while we're doing that. All right, let's put some cloth in this baby here. Yeah, I just can't wait for the new update. Always looking forward to it. Actually, you guys got a good point. Look, if I press, look over here. You know, one of you there, you can take a bow in the comments field, sorry. Uh, that it, if you can still pick it up, then... Oh, crap. That didn't work. Then you know it's actually not there, so you can pick them up. You know very well they're not on fire. Should have never thought of looking. But that's cool. That's a good idea. That's a very good idea. There's one over there too, but at this point, we're gonna let them cook up. Put this away, and it will just way up for this nice body-wise. Get some food. I wish you could paint the rocks here and just put them back in. That'd be pretty cool too. But uh, not part of the game right now. Always like to leave one inside. Again, this makes the oh shit. It's popcorn cool. Why? What the hell is going on? Let's just go up here really quick. Hopefully we will get back before the skulls are all gone. One there, one there, one there, one there. Let's go back, go back, run, run, run. It's supposed to be going carry four skulls. We could carry all these rocks. The bones will stick around, the skulls won't, so priority is the skulls for us right now. There we go. Hopefully we can keep them. Hopefully they're still there. Just a little bit of time. Now they're gone. God darn it. All right, so we're gonna make ourselves a little bit more bone armor. Take one off. Oops. Perfect. Perfect. Man, we have more than enough anyways. The only thing that sucks is using all that cloth. So I'd like to know what you guys want to expecting and hoping for. I know you write them down pretty much every day in the comment fields, and I always appreciate that, because you know what? I do believe the devs uh, haunt comment fields of other YouTube channels uh, all the way around. They must go and check out to see what the, you know, people are talking about. And again, you can always go into the uh, comments in the, uh, well, their forums, sorry, in the comments, but the forums of the games on Steam, and see what they're gonna do and what they're up to. And you can always try and put your opinion there too, because you guys have some really brilliant appearance too. I mean, you have some really good ideas, and you need to go out there and make sure they are aware of it. Those legs are annoying as shit, though. All right, let's do a little more here. How much cloth do I have? One hundred seven. Look how fast it is! Damn it. Three cloth. Come on. It makes it so much harder. I guess that's a good part, right? If it was too easy, kind of suck, wouldn't it? Let's make sure we're full, and then the rest are all gonna be blown there. So, yes. So, thank you so much, guys. We're gonna leave the episode again. Please, if you could leave in the comment fields what you guys are looking forward to, and uh, I'd love to talk back and forth on that. That'd be pretty darn cool. And uh, again, try and check out to see what the updates are gonna be, what we're gonna do. It's coming up right now, I and mean, it's not far away. And uh, hopefully we'll get some goodies. Again, these developers have not really let us down. If it's not a fix for AI or other things, they will be adding on some extra goodies. Anything's always good. Hopefully we'll just add one or two goodies with it. At least one. Be nice. Yeah. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for being here. You guys are absolutely awesome. This is the Edge for Game Edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.